Hello student, now we are going to study about uh, geography paper first, that is human geography. Now we have to study about unit number 4, settlements. This uh, unit uh, consists of four sub topics and these are definition and types of rural settlements then patterns of rural settlements then definition and functional classification of uh, urban settlements and last sub topic is recent trends and patterns of urbanization in India. A, uh, topic A, definition and types of rural settlements. Settlement is one of the basic needs of human after food and clothes. A place where people settle is known as settlement. A man construct houses and develop settlements to protect themselves against environmental hazards and attack of wild animals. Manvacha Prathamik Austet to फळे व कंदमुळे गोळा करणे शिकार करणे मासेमारी करणे व त्यातून आपली उपजीविका भागवणे असे भटके जीवन जगत होता नैसर्गिक आपत्ती हिंसक शापदापासून संरक्षण या अनेक कारणांमुळे त्याने संरक्षित जागा निवडण्याचा प्रयत्न सुरू केला त्याने गुहांचा आश्रयासाठी वापर केला काळाच्या ओघात कुटुंब टोळ्या सामुदायिक जीवनाचा विकास होऊ लागला व निवाऱ्याच्या सुरक्षित सुरक्षिततेच्या गरजेतून मानवाने तात्पुरत्या वसाहतींची निर्मिती केली मानवाच्या भटक्या जीवनात परिवर्तन होऊन स्थिरता येऊ लागली वसाहतींचा विकास होऊ लागला बिफोर द इन्व्हेन्शन ऑफ अॅग्रिकल्चर ह्युमन बिईंग वेअर नो मेड सेटलमेंट इज अ मॅन्स इम्पॉर्टंट स्टेप टुवर्ड्स अडॉप्टिंग हिमसेल्फ to his physical environment. It is believed that permanent settlement first came into existence in the flood plains of the rivers like the Indus, the Tigris, the Euphrates and the Angad Sea and uh, they evolved in a different parts of the world. Then the definition of uh, settlements. According to Ayan Singh, settlement is uh, defined as settlement is an organized colony of a human being including the houses in which they live or work or store various things and track or streets over which their movement take place. Then the term settlement refers to the humanization of a natural landscape by man. Fertile land favorable climate, proper water supply, transport, mineral, 
mineral, uh, mineral resources etc factors encourage people to settle in one place if uh, cold heat altitude etc uh, altitude are high discourage the people to settle on the basis of uh, human activities settlements are commonly divided into two groups and uh, these are rural settlements and urban settlements rural settlements are agriculture oriented settlements and urban settlements uh, depend on industries and a uh, service sector for their livelihood most of the world settlements are rural settlements any settlement having population less than 5000 persons density not more than 400 persons per square kilometer and at least 75 percent of population is engaged in agriculture forestry mining and fishery etc uh, economic activities is uh, known as a rural settlement it is uh, often called as a agricultural workshop then types of uh, rural settlements rural settlement is a one whose inhabitant depend for their livelihood upon the exploitation of the soil in most villages a majority of inhabitants are occupied in farming types of settlements are determined by physical and socio cultural factors some of the major types of settlements these are compact settlements semi compact settlements then dispersed settlements compact settlements compact settlement is also known as nucleated settlement or clustered settlement in this type of settlement the houses are constructed close to each other in compact settlements the streets are very narrow majority of people are engaged in a primary activities such as farming fishing mining etc temple the banyan tree tank fort and uh, land holders houses are generally found at the center of the settlements compact rural settlement manje uh, kendrit वसाह किंवा केंद्रित वस्ती विशिष्ट ठिकाणी एकवटलेल्या घरांना किंवा वस्तीलाच केंद्रित वस्ती किंवा वसाहत असे म्हणतात विशिष्ट ठिकाणी भौगोलिक परिस्थिती अनुकूल असलेल्या या सर्व सुविधांनी व सर्व सुविधांनी युक्त अशा ताटीवाटीने किंवा जवळजवळ अंतरावर उभारलेल्या घरांच्या समुदायाला किंवा वसाहतींना केंद्रित वसाहती असे म्हणतात कृषी संपन्न सुपीक मैदानी प्रदेशात अशा दाट केंद्रित वसाहती आढळतात इन इंडिया दीज सेटलमेंट्स आर फाउंड इन हायली प्रॉडक्टिव्ह एल्युव्हियल प्लेन्स लाईक इंडो गंगा प्लेन ओरिसा कोस्ट कोस्टल एरिया ऑफ आंध्र प्रदेश त्रिपुरा एक्सेट्रा पीपल लिव इन कॉम्पैक्ट सेटलमेंट्स फॉर सिक्युरिटी रिजन्स ऑल्सो मैक्म सेटलमेंट्स ऑफ आवर कंट्री कम अंडर दिस कैटेगरी 
The compact settlements are also found in eastern China, Bangladesh, Java, Pakistan, Thailand, Sri Lanka, Nepal, Brazil, Egypt, etc. Then semi-compact settlements. Semi-compact settlement is also known as quasi-compact rural settlement. In this type of uh, settlement, one or more satellite settlements are found which are linked with the main settlement with the footpath or metal or unmetalled road. Semi-compact settlement is a transitional phase in the growth of compact settlement. Semi-compact settlement is also uh, known as quasi-compact rural settlement due to adoption of a new technology or increase in population density, the scattered settlements starts to convert into semi-compact settlements, caste and class systems may lead to develop a semi-compact settlement. Semi-compact settlements have a nuclei or meeting point where all the people used to meet and celebrate their festivals. Semi-compact settlements are generally found in semi-arid regions and areas of low water table. Such type of settlements are found in the part of Aravalli mountain regions. Uh, then, uh, regions in the states of in the state of Rajasthan, hilly parts of Madhya Pradesh, Manipur, Meghalaya, Mizoram, Arunachal Pradesh. Tripura, Valley of Brahmaputra, etc. Population density of semi-compact settlement ranges between 200 to 500 persons per square kilometer. In a semi-compact settlement type, the houses occupy open spaces and lead to semi-compact settlement which ultimately acquires a nucleated, uh, nucleated settlements. Then dispersed settlements, we could really have us there. Whenever few houses are found quite apart from each other on a ideal location is known as a dispersed or, or sprinkled settlements. These settlements are also known as isolated settlements. Dispersed settlements are usually found in the areas of extreme climate, hills, plateaus, rough terrain, desert land, extensive cultivation area, grassland, etc. Bhagulik Arthadayan Mude ज्या वसाहतींमधील घरी दूर दूर अंतरावर विखुरलेले असतात त्या वसाहतींना विखुरित किंवा विखुरलेले विखुरलेल्या वसाहती असे म्हणतात दीज सेटलमेंट्स आर फाउंड इन ग्रासलँड्स व्हेअर फार्म्स आर लार्ज इन साईज सच ॲज प्रेरीज ऑफ नॉर्थ अमेरिका Pampas of Argentina, the world of South Africa, and Downs of Australia. In India, these settlements are found in Northern Ossi Tract, Ganga Delta, Mountain Tract of Himalaya, Vindhyachal, Nilgiri, and Third Desert of Rajasthan. Similarly, some people leave the main settlements due to overpopulated area and uh, reside in a new settlement. Such a settlements are found in the plains of uh, northern India. In this way, there are uh, 
the types of uh, rural settlements these are compact settlement uh, these are compact settlement semi compact settlement and uh, dispersed or isolated settlements uh, next part will be continued during the next lecture thank you